heard one person say the church nowadays is neither super nor natural. Everything's very predictable and everything is expected. Um, you, you plan, and, and, and there's a truth to that. I mean, I, I feel bad about it, but being around the church culture and even leading a, a gathering of believers, I've gotten pretty good at predicting what's gonna happen in a church service. I can tell you, you know what, hey, this message is gonna be a pretty good one. I think most people like it, or actually some people are gonna have a problem with this. I'm gonna get a lot of emails. You know, oh, the band's gonna sing this song, and at the end, you know, they get it all ramped up, and the, the guitar makes this sound, and everyone's gonna just start, you know, just clapping, applauding right here, or, or I'll go, oh, gosh, she's singing this all day. I don't think it's me that great. You know, it's it's everything so predictable. Was that the way it was supposed to to happen? When, when Jesus says, "No, there's there's a power. There's going to be a supernatural power, and and you are going to receive this supernatural power," and and it was happening. It, it, it was happening. It was seen. It was noticed. In fact, they would say that. People were astonished by the boldness of Peter and John. People were astonished by this courage that those early believers had. When Jesus said this power would come upon you, it really did come upon them, and they were powerful beings. 